हेलो डियर स्टूडेंट्स हाउ आर यू ऑल आई होप यू ऑल आर गुड एंड डूइंग वेल एंड आई नो दैट यू ऑल आर इन्जॉइंग योर ऑनलाइन क्लासेस दिस इज योर सब्जेक्ट टीचर ऑफ इंग्लिश फ्रॉम एल पी एम पब्लिक स्कूल विच इज सिचुएटेड एट गोला बाजार गोरखपुर सो स्टूडेंट टूडे इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन यू अबाउट अ न्यू चैप्टर दैट इज चैप्टर सेवेंटीन एट वर्ब्स You know what is an adverb? An adverb is a word that is used to change, modify or qualify several types of words including an adjective, a verb, a clause, another adverb or any other type of word or phrase with the exception of determiners and adjectives that directly modify nouns a good way to understand adverbs is to think about them as the words that provide context specifically adverbs provide a description of how where when in what manner and to what extent something is done or happens normally we can spot an adverb by the fact that it often ends in ly but there are lots of adverbs that don't end in this way moreover adverbs can be used in many combinations with each other traditionally considered a single part of speech adverbs perform a wide variety of functions making it difficult to treat them as a single unified category however spotting an adverb as especially one that end in ly is easy adverbs normally help paint a fuller picture by describing how something happens as you can see here match the phrases in column a with the words in column b first of all what you have to do you have to match the column a with the column b like first one is i won't go to school and our answer is i won't go to school is tomorrow we will match the first one with word tomorrow first one with c i won't go to school tomorrow second one lata sings sweetly second one is lata sings sweetly third one is the train arrived late the train arrived late and in fourth one come here fifth one is the students shouted loudly in this sentence is as in the first one i won't go to school tomorrow tomorrow is an adverb of time and lata sings sweetly sweetly is the adverb of manner and the train arrived late late is the adverb of time and come here here is the adverb of place the students the students shouted loudly here the word loudly is an adverb of manner the words that describes verb or tell us how when or where an action takes place are called adverbs now read these sentences first one lisa did her work neatly the kite flies up in the sky mini will go to the party 
late in this sentence is neatly up and late are adverbs as they describe the verbs now read these sentences yamini danced gracefully sonia walked slowly the baby cried loudly in this sentence is the words gracefully slowly and loudly tell us the manner in which an action is done these words are adverbs of manner and adverbs which tells us how an action takes place is called an adverb of manner read this sentences let's go to the park now we will visit the exhibition tomorrow my father brought home a puppy yesterday here in the sentences the words now tomorrow yesterday tell us when the action takes place these words are adverbs of time now the next type of adverb is adverbs of place now read this sentences the beggar is standing there please come here aman is playing inside in this sentences the words there here inside tell us where the actions take place these words are adverbs of place means there are three types of adverbs and they are adverb of manner adverb of manner adverb of time and adverb of place adverb of an adverb of manner will explain how an action is carried out very often adverbs of manner are adjectives with ly added to the end but this is certainly not always the case in fact some adverbs of manner will have the same spelling as the adjective form some examples of adverbs of manner include slowly rapidly clumsily badly diligently sweetly warmly sadly and the second type of adverbs are and adverbs of time adverb of time an adverb of time while seemingly similar to adverbs of frequency tell us when something happens adverbs of time are usually placed at the end of a sentence for example now tomorrow yesterday and the third type of adverb is an adverb of place an adverb of place sometimes called special adverbs will explain where a action happens adverbs of place will be associated with the action of the verb in a sentence providing context for direction distance and position for example south east everywhere up left close by back inside around these terms don't usually end in ly so children this was all about the chapter adverb i hope you have understood read this chapter that's it for today thank you